Okay, so I want to talk about Amazon's review system because it really fucking pisses me off. Um, I, I mean, I'm trying to find a review for something, say. You want to find a review uh, for the Hopog HD PVR, so let's just go HD PVR Rocket, right? The Rocket, the portable HD PVR. Okay, let's find that. And here we are. Okay. Great, wonderful. So I click on it. I could technically just click on the reviews, but I'm just doing that for no reason. All right, so we see we have 843 customer reviews, which are making up a four-star rating, right? Okay, we click on that that thing where it tells you these are the customer reviews for the... And if we look up right here, the Hallpog HD PVR Rocket Portable Standalone 1080p Video Game Recorder for Xbox, PlayStation, and PC systems, gaming systems. More than that, but I left out a few things, but I guess the title needs to be a little, can't be too long. All right, so what's this? Great for recording video game consoles, but what's this? Hop Hog 1212 HD PVR High Definition Personal Video Recorder for Computers. What's that for, though? That's, well, the first HD PVR. Why am I seeing reviews for something else there? Why are those devices changing the review, the, the overall ratings for the device that I'm, for this? This is not that. Why am I seeing reviews here that are not for the rocket and they are changing the rating system the ratings are being adjusted so basically it's all the hop devices are being reviewed in this one area so i don't i can't tell you what that rating what that rating means this means nothing it's a rating for nothing maybe the company i mean it's basically a rating for the company because this is every single Hopog device is listed in the reviews. It's not giving you a review of this device here. It's giving you a review of everything. It's, it gives you reviews of the HD PVR2, the HD PVR1, the Rocket. Everything that Hopog made is being reviewed. Not this. But it tells you that it's reviewing this. This thing right here, the Rocket. But you can't get the reviews it's very hard to find a review for this on Amazon's website. And these, these ratings mean nothing. These ratings mean absolutely nothing. What, ugh, I hate this. I noticed that when I was looking for a review on the Rocket, and then I found the same thing. I was re looking for a review on a, an SD card, and I had the same issue. There were reviews for the 64 gigabyte, the 16 gigabyte, the 8 gigabyte, the this, the that. And there was, it was no definitive Review, there was no, like, I couldn't find X amount of reviews for a specific item. It had to be everything just jumbled in one, which makes this rating system right here totally fucking useless. And it makes me want to come over to Amazon. If I could break Amazon.com, like, physically, maybe I guess that's what they meant, like, when they talked about with, um, you know, uh, what was his face? You know, uh, God damn it. Apple's, um... What's his face? God damn it, that guy. <laughs> that guy. Uh, Steve Jobs. There you go. Steve Jobs. When he's sitting there talking all that weird stuff about being able to touch the internet, I wish I could break the internet. I'd love to be able to touch the internet because I take it and smash it sometimes. But <laughs> I don't know. Like I, Sometimes I want to look up a review on something to know if I want to get it, to know if it has problems or if it doesn't have problems, if I want to buy it from Amazon, you know. Um, and I want to check the reviews, but I can't now. I really can't, because what do these reviews mean? They mean nothing. These reviews mean absolutely nothing. I can't do anything with this. This is garbage. If you're going to review things like this, if you're going to have a rating system like this, just take the fucking reviews out. Take them down. It doesn't even matter.